black spots. So now, diets are feeding these animals this morning. This is about pan feed for the morning. They'll get fed again in the early afternoon. So they get fed twice a day. That's a smooth stingray. They get fed separately. We have tours behind the scenes where they get fed, uh, but they're a little bit cheeky and like to come around and see what's going on anyway. <laughs> Bit of a scratch on the head from Leo the leopard shark. We know he's a boy shark. We can see these two white long feet there. Those are called claspers. That's how we know he's a boy shark. That's what boy and uh, sharks and rays have. So rays have their eyes on the top of their head, and they have their nostrils, mouth, and gills on their belly. And that means they can't see what they're eating. Mr. G's coming closer again. When we look at our sharks, we can see the gills at the side, eyes at the side, mouth and nostrils at the front. That's how we can tell our rays and sharks apart from each other. Oh, off he goes. He's a pretty fast fish when he needs to be. But he's still circling around. We have a fish that looks almost like Mr. G, but smaller with spots. Those are called potato pods. That's mash, and we have a large potato pod named Spud. So Spud and mash. Oh, no. He's off somewhere else, we'll get that quickly. Looks like one of the rays will get it down there. We've got a brown band of bamboo shark at the bottom. This tiny little shark here, can anyone can see That's the yellow tiny big fish. Do I want the fish? No. And Twelly is also popular in our diapies. Some other food besides feed are blue mackerel, bonitos, and pilchard, but those fish are quite fatty and tasty. We don't want to tempt, tempt some of the other sharks here, because we don't want any animals fighting over food. So blue mackerel and bonitos are the, the sand bar whalers who get fed separately by the Kirajoro staff at surface. So we're just coming in and you're up in the coming in from the tunnel, there is still standing room behind the couch if you, if you can't see from where you are. There's our brown band of bamboo sharks. That's quite a young shark there, but they're, they're not a very big shark. They are quite a small species. This is a tawny nurse shark over here. Oh, that tawny nurse shark is a bit slow. Oh, pat on the head, tawny nurse shark. <laughs> so we have two types of eagle rays, they're the southern eagle ray and the white spotted eagle ray. So one lives well in South Australia and the white spotted is the tone where it's. There's Dino the bone our shark ray over there. She looks a bit like a ray in the front and a shark in the back, but she's in fact a ray. When she comes around again you'll be able to see she has her nostrils, mouth and gills and her belly, like our rays do. Solomon was a bit cheeky there, getting some squid right from the bucket. He loves to eat squid. Some squid for the leopard shark as well. It is all human quality fish and seafood from the local fish market, so it is actually good enough for us to eat. So they do get very quality food. Um. Uh, and need 
to um, need to be hand fed. So if you're looking um, through the tunnel, just allow space uh, through the middle for people to get through. Now for most of you, you've come through uh, from the entrance and you've come down through this level. So if you're if you're familiar with the environment you come here, often you might notice you're going in a different order than you usually would. Because we've changed the, the direction of our journey here. So the next part of the aquarium, for those of you who are used to the usual pathway, is actually the other way. So through here, to the left, is where the next part of the aquarium is. 